it's interesting that Camilla didn't downplay the catches in this piece. That tells me that clearly Camilla knows what Harry and Meghan said about it. It was true. It's very, very unfortunate. I don't know if all of you have come across the telegram that Tomini had posted and the title starts, Prince Harry is very backward looking for suing the British tabloids. We all know very well that Prince Harry is suing the tabloids because of phone hacking, not the catches, neither the paparazzi. The main reason and exact reason as to why Prince Harry is suing the Daily Mirror, it's all simply because of them invading his privacy by hacking his phone. And I'll take you through an article written by Kezia. It goes ahead and says, and I quote, as someone who regularly monitors and discusses the British media and the royal commentary, let me just say, the vibe has been off for much of the past months. It's been off since Prince Harry made his quick solo appearance at the coronation. It was frankly chilling to watch the British media decide to question, mock, and misrepresent the Duke and Duchess of Sussex's running in with the paparazzi. In New York, I still believe that there was some kind of plan, some kind of operation, and it was rathered by Harry and Meghan, their security, and uh, the new, the NYPD. How much of this vibe shit is related to Harry's court case appearance this week in London for his trial against the Mira group? Perhaps some of it is related, but I don't think it's solemnly about this trial. One thing for sure though, hit dogs holler and the British royal commentators don't know what to do with themselves or how to speak about Harry's crusade against them. You can also see in the Camilla Tomini latest at the telegram. He wrote an I quote and it says, it's very backward looking trying to avenge the people he thinks caused his mother's death. Think about what kind of deranged it takes to say what to say that with a straight face. To make the argument that seeking justice is very backward looking. I fail to understand why. The fact that Harry is seeking justice for what the Mirror Group did to him doesn't mean that he is trying to revenge with the whole thing that happened to his mother. Yes, we know very well that the main reason as to why Princess Diana lost her life was simply because of the paparazzis. It, that was the main reason. But Tomini shouldn't make it seem as if Prince Harry is trying to revenge. Tomini shouldn't make it seem as if that's the main case that is taking Prince Harry to court. Yet Prince Harry made it well clear. The main reason as to why he's going to court is to seek justice for the fact that the mirror invaded his privacy by hacking his phone. We know very well that's unlawful and that's why Prince Harry decided to take these matters to the next level and that is going to court. For Tomini, I guess people reporting and charging rapists and murderers are very backward looking too. And again, while Diana's death affected very single part of Harry's life, make no mistake, this trial isn't about paparazzi and uh, car chases, it's about phone hacking and uh, Balgin and Palace briefings. This is just Tomini and all of the royal commentators being scared to death that they are about to be exposed, that accountability might come for them too. We know very well that of lot, most of the people who know very well that 
are also involved in this matter that Harry has taken to court have started shivering. They have started bringing about lame excuses, knowing very well or bearing in mind that they are soon going to be exposed. They are soon going to be exposed. And after Harry has received his justice, most of them are going to face their circumstances. They are going to face their consequences of all their evil deeds that they've been doing all throughout without anyone being able to maybe bring them forward. We know very well that it is not only Harry who has taken this case to court. Phone hacking has been done by the Daily Mail, Daily Mirror group. For so many other people, hundreds of people also who have the same exact accusations towards the daily mail towards the mirror group in court i fail to understand why is it that all the time tomini has to misunderstand each and everything that harry brings clear to people he tries and twists it he tries and flips it and makes it look the other way or tries and bring something else that harry hadn't mentioned at first we know very well that all that Harry wants is justice and he is not taking this case to court. Not because of what happened to her mother. Though he has a right to do so, but that's not the main reason as to why. The main reason is the daily, the mirror group invaded his privacy by hacking his phone. And that's why he took the court, he took the case to court. That was the main reason. It is very unfortunate that she is the only person who always has to misunderstand everything. Allow me to take you through some few comments that people made after seeing whatever Cam Camilla Tomini had uh, posted. Somebody went ahead and said, I think she is scared that the truth about the catches and who it was that funded it is going to come out. And... Uh, the only one backward looking is this old has been who can't be close to anything to do with Harry. Poor little camel toe. Go cry into your typewriter. Your time is been anywhere near believable. It's over. I believe it's the high time she gets ready for anything. Simply because the people who have always been behind all this are going to be soon exposed. Somebody also went ahead and said, Honestly, at this point, nothing shocks me anymore with this, with this a lot. They just make stuff up and miss the point intentionally. I don't know how she sleeps at night. These people have no souls. And it's been coming back to bite them. Camel better watch out. She better dies. She better dies. Somebody also went ahead and said, she still doesn't get it about privacy. Doesn't she not realize that PH already divulged things about himself during the period of his life when they were hacking him? And uh, that the tabloids had already divulged things when they had hacked him. How is he losing more hacked privacy? Do they think that they can ask him any questions they want when he's testifying? Inquire about his life now. The privacy he wants is for his children who have nothing to do with this case. We know very well that whatever Harry is also trying to do, he's trying to lay a foundation and protect his kids. He saw what happened to him and Harry after his mother passed away. And that's not the same thing he wants it to repeat itself and happen to his kids. That's why all he wants is justice and nothing but justice. Somebody also went ahead and says, you know, I was thinking exactly that. 
this unhinged person writes for the troll graph now. But I don't remember if she worked for another of the tablets during the years in question. I wouldn't be surprised if she's personally involved in some of it. We won't be surprised. The same way he, she keeps on defending things and things that are not logic. We fail to understand and we won't be surprised if she was amongst the people funding. We don't know yet to see all that after Harry is done with his court case. Justice will prevail and the truth will automatically come out. That was our today's podcast. See you in our next podcast. Bye guys and thank you so much for tuning in. See you.